Hello everyone. Welcome to you all on the YouTube channel of Chameli Devi Institute of Pharmacy Indore. In this session, we will going to discuss about clinical laboratory tests. Content of this session would be what are the lab tests? Why does your doctor use lab tests? How are lab tests are analyzed? What do lab tests shows? Factors that affect lab test results and types of clinical laboratory test. So, clinical laboratories are healthcare facilities providing wide range of laboratory procedures which at the physician is carrying out the diagnosis, treatment and management of patients. These laboratories are made by medical technologists that is clinical laboratory scientists who are trained to perform various tests to sample of biological specimen collected from its patients. The laboratory tests are medical devices that are intended for the use on sample of blood, urine or other tissues or substances taken from the body to help diagnose diseases or other conditions. Most of the clinical laboratories are situated within and or near hospital facilities to provide access to both physician and their patients. What does your doctor use lab test? So, your doctor uses laboratory test to help identifying changes in your health conditions before any symptoms occurs, diagnose or add in diagnosing a disease or condition, plan your treatment for disease or conditions, evaluate your responses to a treatment and monitor the course of disease over time. How are lab tests are analyzed? So, after your doctor collects a sample from your body, it is sent to a laboratory. Laboratories perform tests on the sample to see if it contains different substances and how much. It's depending on the test, the presence, absence or amount of analyte may mean you do have a particular condition or it may mean that do not have the particular condition. Sometimes laboratory compare your results to results obtained from previous test to see if there has been change in your condition. What do lab test shows? So, some types of lab test shows whether or not your results fall within in normal ranges. Normal test values are usually given as a range rather than a specific number because normal values will vary from person to person. What is normal for one person may not be normal to another person. Other type shows whether there is a particular substance present or absent such as a mutation in gene or an infection organism which indicates whether you have a disease, an infection or may or may not respond to a therapy. Some laboratory traced are price, precise, reliable, indicators of a specific health problems while other provides more general information that gives doctor clues to your possible health problems. Information obtained from laboratory test may help doctors decide whether other tests or procedures are needed to make a diagnosis or to develop or revise a previous treatment plan. All laboratory tests are results must be interpreted within in the context of your overall health and should be used along with other exam or tests. What factors that can affect your lab test results? So many factors can affect test results including your sex, age, race, medical history, general health, specific food content, drug you are taking so, how closely you follow preparatory instructions, variations in laboratory techniques as well, variations from laboratory to another laboratory. 
types of clinical lab test so it depends on health conditions or test categories if we are talking about health condition then there may be a various kind of health diseases like heart disease respiratory disease cervical cancers colorectal cancers diabetes and stage renal disease hiv aids influenza health care associated infections these health conditions have various kind of test examples if we are talking about heart disease then it may have lipid panel or cholesterol triglycerides kind of test or test of troponin if we are talking about cervical cancer then it may have pap smear test human papillo virus dna testing for the colorectal cancer test examples may be tcl occult blood test as well as various infections with associated with healthcare so there may be a viral culture may be a molecular typing of microbiology pathogens in the next table you can see here the test categories as well as purpose and their examples so in test category first is general chemistry for its test purpose there are some measurements of body compounds in the body for example urinalysis test strips calcium level test hba1c test and fecal occult blood test these all are involved in the general chemistry tests next one is immunochemistry so their purpose is, is to match antibody antigen response to indicate the presence of level of a protein the example is immunoassay test for troponin antibiotic susceptibility test alpha phytoprotein test hiv antibodies test substances abuse test and tumor maker test there are some more example of test category and test purposes which is mentioned here like hematology purpose of this category is to study the blood or blood producing organs and cells of the body so for these complete blood count would be taken for the test coagulation test and papenicolau smear so for microbiology infection disease kind of category in this category the purpose is to detection of disease causing agents and test would be streptococcal testing bacterial urine urine testing urine culture and west nile virus blood screening other and last category would be molecular testing so in this category study of dna and rna to detect genetic sequences that may indicate presence of susceptibility to disease so there are various category of examples you can see here brca1 and brca2 testing to indicating the individuals risk of developing breast or ovarian cancer nucleic acid hybridization test and nucleic acid amplification test pharmacogenomic profile and hiv viral load testing and other hiv assays so these all are the categories and conditions for the type of clinical laboratory test thank you everyone for watching this session